Previously on Prayer of the Faithless, Aaron and Luke free troll from a locked room, only to find that the monsters tortured two other mana into insanity. The party found the rest of the mana in the basement area, only for the floor to itself to devour them. Although the party managed to defeat the boss and return to the fortress to normal, there's no saving the mana community. Ready to go to Lycrushin Valley? World map? Wait, we can do that? Jump to world map. Oh wow, we get a little shortcut, so... This takes us to that little section we were at before. Actually, because I technically have an inn, I could actually grind a bit, couldn't I? Okay, the enemies in the valley don't give any experience anymore, and there are no items. I tried to check, even the very final room. What? A new area already? Eastern Lacrosian, okay. Now there will be probably a lot stronger enemies. Serrated Knife. It's, this is different from the normal knife. It has a higher bleed chance. I guess she's going to need it considering her party is overall a little weaker than errors. Aw. Oh. Well, I can probably grind against you, right? Yeah, you look pretty strong. I think you're going to be a, a, a good, to, good to grind against since I can skip to the end. Okay. Lightning draw. So you're weak to slash, aren't you? Dang, I didn't brand them. That kind of sucks. Okay. Lightning draw. I cannot brand them. What the heck? Oh no. That only did one damage. They have really high magic resist or something. AoE! I, 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 if I broke your... Uh, he was able to use such a powerful skill even without my asthma charge. That's insane. Power Gouger. Raise, seriously? There we go. And level up. Aurora Seal. Yeah, definitely still want to avoid enemies whenever I can. But at least I have an in. I guess that's to make up for the fact that we don't have a real healer. Now we have a free in again. Hmm. Oh, it can break my asthma charge. But still pretty situational because not every enemy can be branded that, that easily. Oh, a weapon is up there, but how do I get there? Okay, there's an unavoidable enemy on there. There's a lot of unavoidable dudes. Hm, fine. They don't respawn, so let's kill them all. Ah, there's three of them! Okay. 
a lightning draw. Hmm. Did I friend any of these guys? Only you? Seriously? Man. Well, one down. No, my psyche. I'm already... Uh, uh, my psyche has already been lowered. Ah! Okay. Let's use a lightning draw. And hope for better statistics this time. Yes! They have both been branded. I'll have to fight the one at top. That would be redundant. Water flask. Adrenaline flask. Rope. Wait, can I create a shortcut here? Oh, not nice. Sakura blade. How is that compared to the previous blade? It's also slash type. Hmm, seems to have a lot of the same skills. Slim Edge is stronger, but less skill, huh? Wow. Five damage. Always five damage. Okay, that's situa That's pretty situational. Yeah, it's another blade I want to equip situationally. Don't use rope unless I need to. Adrenaline flask. Ah. Retreat and heal. This is not good. Aha. Rune shield. Yes. Reflect medium. Hmm. What the heck is Resonant Shield? Psych Burst, Psych up on all allies. And it can ref reflect magic attacks. Hmm, that could be useful against someone like you. Throwing knife, that's it? Damn. Alright, back to the acid area. Let's go north, because that's all we can do. Cliff sides. I really hope I didn't screw myself over by not making that shortcut. You're definitely hiding something back there, aren't you? Not really. Water flask maxed out, okay. Tomahawk. There's another shortcut. There's a rock. Don't tell me you have to push it. Make, make a decent version for villagers across. 
How do we push it, though? <laughs> no good. The bullet's too heavy to move by ourselves. I apologize. Even if I was in top condition, a modest physical strength could never hope to match a human. Oh, come on. Don't put yourself down over something you can't control. Judging by the size of this boulder, I think even two humans wouldn't be able to budge this thing. Let's keep looking around. I'm sure we'll find something to give us an extra oomph. A puzzle, huh? So we need to find something to get this to form a bridge, and that would allow us to cross in the acid area. And I, I will save this rope until I truly need it. Huh? Shit. Fine, I'll have to break through. Ha <laughs> You'll never take me alive! Valley Ben, another Francisca. No, this is a throwing axe, not a s wieldable one. <sighs> We're gonna need it, aren't we? A uh, Paladin Amelie, may I see your arm? Of, of course, but... It still hurts, doesn't it? How do you know? The wound has closed long ago, but... I thought I saw it before, but I wasn't certain until the last battle when I got a good look at you. When you raise your weapon to strike, your face twists in pain. Why didn't you say anything? If I had known you were hurt this badly, I would never have asked you to come with me. Your concern is touching me, uh, it truly is. However, there's no need to fret over me. As long as I can hold my sword, I can be of service to you on the battlefield. But if you keep straining yourself like this, your wound won't heal. What would happen if it tore open during... That's quite enough. Thinking about such hypotheticals will only cause unnecessary destructions during battle. Or do you believe my usefulness ends with my sword arm? What? No, I just... When Commandant Vanessa brought me to Asala Knights, I swore an oath to her to protect the people of Asala. It's an oath I intend to keep, regardless of what it may cost me. I know the limits of my physical abilities. Please trust me to work with them to ensure I do not slow you down. I see a boss monster. Oh, shit. At least there's a, at least there's a save point nearby. That makes it a little more fair. Wait, you? I fought you before. How many times do we have to teach you this lesson, old man? Are you kidding me? You even have the exact same weaknesses. Pierce only, unfortunately. That, that kind of sucks. Man. Yeah, this is bad. We don't have any way to deal with reliable Pierce-type damage. Hmm. Piercing Light. Six damage, wow. Real fair. Branded. Ah, oh, damn, she just whacked me again, of course. She has two actions per turn. So Cannon Thrust is my only way of actually dealing damage to someone like you. You're still branded. Aurora Seal. I can't really follow up on that, can I? Power Gouger. What? Man, this is tough. Skill Gouger. Ah! 
Strength from pain. Damn, I can't do anything with this status on me. Except maybe use an item on Amelie. Hmm. Add 50% of skill to attack. That could be pretty useful. I have to use magic to get uh, to do something about you, huh? There. Pierce with cannon thrust. What? Another cannon for us to the face. There we go. Lord Saber. Okay, that's that gives you another chance to get the Lord Saber for Amelie. That's really good. Now I have more options for her. Alright, there must be something important up ahead. Something that'll help us with the rock. What? Oh no. Mia, wait. Those guys are corrupted humans. They look at their eyes. They've been poisoned by miasma. Hey, what's going on over there? Oh, looks like it's time to rescue our third and fourth party members. Boy, didn't you hear you lot hear what I said? Let us through. You're disrupting the important business of the Eastern Empire of Virgio. What's wrong with y'all? The fog didn't plug up your ears or nothing. I know you stranded ain't got much sense no more, but surely you can understand the simple move it. There's too many of them. Even with my AoEs. Fine, if that's how you low life act, I'll show you what happens when you defy the great Sarah Cadmus. Go, Rayson, wipe the floor over these suckers. Uh, fine, fine. Let me level with you all for a moment. I just woke up an hour ago, so I ain't feeling up for a workout right now. Don't make this troublesome for me, alright? Hey, what are you doing? I give you an order, Rayson. Go knock the, uh, them all senseless. Oh, uh, but why go through all that effort, boss? When you get to be my age, you ain't got the energy to be bumbling around like that. I reckon you got to catch my drift in a few years. You, you use the spum. Why'd they even choose you as a retainer? Now, now, there ain't no way for someone of your standing to behave. If your face heats up anymore, I can fry a couple eggs on it. Sykes, your performance seems to have gained an audience. That would have happened to Air and Luke if they uh, weren't a revenant and infused, huh? Hey, did, did you two see that just now? Don't get the wrong idea. He doesn't normally ignore my orders. I just... Um, uh, quite the energetic young lady, is she not? We gotta kill them if we want to get through this valley anyways. Sorry about the boss here. She's a good kid. Just hadn't exactly dug the ditches with the rest of us peons, you know? Anyway, y'all ain't wobbling around and moaning, so I guess you ain't stranded. Go see a couple of friendly faces around. Wait, I'm seeing something. Grayson, target approaching at your at your 120. Excuse me, but do you have any idea how rude that was? You don't just hack away at someone when they're in the middle of a conversation. Guess I shouldn't expect much from Stranded. The fog's blotted out any humanity left in y'all. Wait, what just happened? How does he know the person? How do you know the person was coming? That has to be some sort of code the girl shouted at to alert him. G guess that's my lovely morning ruined. Anyway, this party's just getting started. If y'all want in on the action, I'll make sure to save you a couple. He seems quite relaxed for someone in their situation. Almost as if he knows he can win without, uh, even without our help. That's no reason to abandon someone in need. Come on, let's go down and help them. Mia, hold Mia, look over there. Oh no, more of those people. We gotta take out the ones up top before the ones on the bottom, or we'll be too surrounded. It'd be wise to eliminate them here before they can attack the pair below. But won't we be in danger if we leave them? 
Remember your training, Mia. Divide the forces to, to engage the enemy in smaller numbers to reduce risk. If we not stop them here, the battlefield will fall into chaos and we could perish. We don't want them to have the high ground. That, the man can clearly take care of the two of them for now. Let us reduce the no enemy numbers before joining them. Okay, got it. Wait, you're gonna make me manually walk over, huh? Okay. Do we even stand a chance with our current supplies? Yeah, we got 10 first aid kits. I think this will be fine. On slot. Okay, next up is Lightning Draw. And then Provoke to be safe. No! Doesn't Fear make her even even better tank though? Seems like a bad move on your part. They're all weak to Slash. Nimble Stranded, I need to take you out first. Okay, you're all that's left. You're no longer branded, which kind of sucks. Wait. Where are you weak to? There we go. There's so many! Even- they're all along this trail. Well, whatever. If I get- if I need to, I'll just spam first aid kits. I got plenty I can fall back on. Including the ones on the ground. With that, the reinforcements are no more. No time to lose. Let's go save the others. There's a cave here. Is there a resting point inside? All right, you're here. See, Racing, I knew we'd be okay. Oh, come on, boss. You make it sound like I couldn't have handled these clowns on my own. Do you have AOE attacks? So I guess we got some new buddies, eh? For now, anyway. Heh, <laughs> good enough for me. Keep close, Sarah. This party's about to get crazy. Got it. With my powers combined with everyone's fighting force, we've got this in the bag. Get ready, you stranded. You're about to face divine punishment. That's too many. Man, what a pain. What do you do? Do you... You have single target attacks, but I don't see any AoE shit. What the heck is Insight Med? Does that give us really high dodge rates? I wish they'd just give... Uh, damn it, they don't give me... A, they give me the tutorial after the actual battle. That is so messed up. Magic. They function as a single unit, which is probably why they have so much hit points. But there's still, I don't have enough AoE power here. If I want to use everyone's skills evenly, I'm gonna have to use blade. Well, I'm gonna have to start with lightning draw to brand as many as possible. I probably, I don't know which which one is better. Do I want to use vision of assault or med? What does this- what's the friggin' difference? I'm guessing Insight gives me higher Graze chance, so let's go with that first. Failed? How did it fail on the ver- on the person who cast it? 
That's ridiculous. At least I didn't fail on the t provoke her. Oh, hell no. Even with high graze rate, this looks pretty messed up. Okay, good. Fear is actually good. What? This is... Br that, that That's stupid. Oh, look at the sleek moves on you, girl. I ain't seen nothing like you on this side of the world. And me, um... Excuse me, this is not a time in sh for casual chit-chat. Please stay focused on the battle. Oh, come on. Ain't nothing wrong with a little art appreciation, right? Art. Why you fail on so many people? At least Fearful Aura gave me a bit more defense to work with, but that was... A mono-wielding human weapons and armor. It ain't something you see every day, that's for sure. I believe I've asked you to keep your mouth shut and focus on the battle. Oh, so harsh. I knew it fought mana outside the Kyoma were more active and cheerful. Lighten up, lady. Excuse me, can we please save this room we're safe? You all ain't any fun. Oh, I'm... I'm out of steam. At least the enemy numbers are thinned out a little bit. Oh no. Counter stance, really? No. Damn it, even when they fin their numbers, they still have an advantage. Hmm. Good, this time we got insight set correctly. There. Got them all somehow. Swift punishment learned. 
That was quite an army. These, those poor people. It pays me to see humans reduced to such a monstrous sight. Woohoo, now that's what I call divine punishment. Great work, team. Huh. Anyway, are you two okay? <sighs> Ow. Alright, that's as far as you get. This party ain't over just yet. Take another step closer and I'll send y'all right behind them stranded. Grayson, what do you think you're doing? Stand on this instant. That's an order. No can do, boss. I'm, I ain't about to let a couple of kooks like them near you until I get a handle on them. Even if they were helpful before. Kooks? Excuse me, this is quite poor treatment of those who just saved you. Piff, saved. As if a group of decomposing stranded were anything a guy like me needed saving from. Besides, I see a human of hair colored like a mana and a mana clad in human armor together on the outskirts of the deep fog. Even the most reckless of idiots would give you all a double take. So, you want to talk? Fine, do it from there. Is my hair really that odd? Everyone, please, let us all lower our weapons and speak to each other calmly. Is that acceptable? I'll either speak with you or lower my weapon. Pick one. Please, sir, we don't mean either of you any harm. How about we introduce ourselves before this gets out of hand? I'll start. My name is Mia Alacruz. I lead a group of refugees from the village of Honolith, west of here. I am Paladin Amelie of the Assault Knights. Get out of here. You're Paladin Amelie? Hmm, well, you seem to fit the description of Paladin Amelie from what I've read. Amelie, how can these people recognize you? We have never met personally, but I may have acquired a sort of reputation. I have been sent to various places across the continent before the deep fog cut off access. Alright, right, so you got some cred. Amana with hair covering half her face and clad in red armor is a lot of points to get to be written off as coincidence. Grayson, that's my name. Ain't got no surname. And this here is Sarah. We're just a pair of traveling merchants. The name's Sarah. Sarah Cadmus. However, you may all call me Oracle Cadmus. Oracle, wait. You're an Oracle of the Eastern Kingdom of Virgio? Oh, an Oracle? Please, I am the Oracle of the Eastern Kingdom of Virgio. See, unlike the others, my powers have been returned to me. It's okay, you can all pick your jaws up from the floor. I really am that awesome. Impossible. Every oracle lost her powers when the fog first emerged 16 years ago. But Amelie, we saw her powers in that last battle. She predicted some of the enemy's moves before they even happened. If that isn't the power of an oracle, I don't know what is. The only oracle I've heard of who had regained her lost power is the one who spoke the last prophecy. They clearly recall she was put to death in Virgio. Grayson, do you hear? Everyone thinks I'm dead. Our diversion worked. Well, it worked right up until the moment when you blow our cover wide open. Fantastic job, boss. Oh, um, whoops. Wait, did you just say you are the oracle who spoke the last prophecy? Then she must know about error. That gonna be a problem? Stand down, we know more than anyone the truth of the prophecy. It has, after all, come to fruition on our very doorstep. Oh no, so that pillar of light really was. You both saw it, too. There's no need to conceal the fact. It is true. A remnant now walks the earth. Lost prophecy has already come to fruition. Grayson! I know, boss, I know. We shall explain the details to you later if you wish. For now, we must continue with our task of blazing a trail for the refugees to follow. Sir Grayson, Lady Sarah, I hate to impose, but... It's fine, we were on our way to warn us all about the Revenant anyway. Guess there's no point now. Yes, we all know about the Revenant now. Mia! Grayson, let's go over them for now. They aren't a threat to us, and we shouldn't be standing in the open anyway, or else we might attract more of them. Yep, you got a point. All right then, we'll stick with you too for a while. I've got my eye on y'all though, so no funny business. Oh man. Finally we get a proper tutorial about how their stuff works. Race and battle tactics. Jack of all trades. D he can use a weapon and he has a, and also so, uh, uh, can use different elements, huh? You can fight with a weapon in each hand, but you can equip every kind of weapon the party can come across. Extreme versatility comes at a cost, however. He has no burst strikes of his own. He has no burst strikes, but his charge Sarah Cadmus is more than capable of filling that role. She can tap into the future and predict attacks, see weaknesses of an enemy, and even predict the immediate death of an enemy. The ability to see the future is a life-saving one. You can easily turn the tie of battle. Plus, seeing as Racing is not performing these actions, they will come to no cost of uh, to come at no cost of Racing's SP. Unfortunately, Sarah's powers are rather unstable. As such, they may occasionally fail. Use some of caution. That is going to be complicated. 
I don't know the difference between insight and vision of assault. But pinpoint does seem pretty useful. Okay, she can use trace to as a self buff. Is he an infused or something? He seems to have elemental powers. Years of experience has have given race an expertise with nearly every weapon. He can wield one in each hand. Lazy mind. 50% resistance to all emotional effects. He can even equip Sakura Blade. And use all the, uh, the skills listed on it too. Strike and Slash. He's got really high power to begin with. Hmm. It's gonna be a complicated character to play as. Okay, what's in this cave, though? Ah! They're still here? Are you kidding me? So if I want to get the treasure in the cave, I have to kill all the enemies within it. But first I need to save. This is dangerous. Level 25, he's quite strong, or maybe I'm just underleveled. No, I can't be that underleveled. The enemies weren't giving that much experience to me. Okay, so continuing downward would probably get me to that shortcut that I'm probably not going to use my rope on because I'm too stingy, but there must be something in this cave. I bet the secret to breaking the rock is inside. So let's kill everyone inside and get my loot. Will these guys respawn? You ain't worth spit. Both used up. Okay, let's fight you. It's a boss! Man, what a pain! Tell me about it. I was not prepared. It's too many! This game is fucking insane. Of course you gave everyone fucking miasma right off the bat. What am I supposed to do anymore? Ugh. Oh, that was painful. That was brutal, horrible, everything bad.
Tim. My goodness, this is horrible. First aid kit to be safe. Oh no. Where's Luke when you need him? Okay, I need to, before I can use an AOE physical, I need to use magic. Provoke. Lightning draw. Good, that gives me more defense, which is perfect for my tank. I like it when they use Spearful Aura on Amelie. Okay, exhausted. <laughs> yeah, let's just use some ice magic on you. Done. Oh, we got Rune Ruhail. That's hopefully that's good. All right, self will take us to something that will... Oh, come on, there's more of those stranded. The edge. Oh my goodness, they're everywhere. Aha. Evade everyone. There was... Uh, oh, now that we have more people, we can actually go to the... Uh, go here. But I don't want to use the rope. I have a feeling I might need it for something else. So yeah, let's hold out on that. Both four of us. All right, everyone, one, two, push. Yay, so score another point for the power of teamwork. Now we have a bridge for the refugees to cross. Let's hope there weren't any. There wasn't anyone walking there. With that out of the way, it's time to discuss our next move. So, Racing, Lady Sarah, may I ask where the two of you came from? We found some good shelter a couple days ago in the ruins of Lavengard. Not exactly a luxurious inn, but good enough for a night or two. Wait, did you just say Lavengard? We were given strict orders from Commandant Vanessa to avoid that village, as it had become a nest for Miasma monsters. Hey, we didn't see any monsters there. Well, no more monsters than usual. Besides, no monsters don't make nests last time I heard checked. If there is a nest, it's underground, where all the Miasma is. Been that way since the beginning of time. Did Vanessa lie to us somehow? I think this is worth checking into. Held in advance and the others will need more time to complete their wagons. So a quick recon mission should, shouldn't delay us very long. Grayson, Sarah, can you please show us the way to Lavengard? Of course, we'll be happy to help. Lavengar is just east of the Lacrishin Valley. You can't miss it. This is absurd. Vanessa would not lie to us like this. Doubt she's lying, but maybe Lavengar was overrun by monsters last time she had eyes on the place and never bothered to check back in later? Either way, Lavengar is no monster nest. We'll take you there to prove it. Oi. Yeah, I'm not even using any rope. Who needs rope? Rope is sort of weak. 
Wait, there's a skit here. So there is a point to bring you back here. I knew it. Ooh, you're all gonna love Virgio. We've got cake, candy, and a dancing festival every night. When we get there, I'll let you have the sweet caramel ice cream that Racing always gets me. It's the best. Aha, I knew it. Sarah has quite a bit of energy, doesn't she? Oh, you don't know half of it. That girl doesn't know the meaning of the phrase slow down. It takes everything I've got just to keep up with her. But you're still her loyal retainer. Yep, she gives me a headache, but seeing her run around with all the energy is comforting. In times like these, it's a little comfort goes a long way. The world's holding the royal flesh, kid. Ain't no way humanity's gonna win out this round. Yet we all got something to keep us in this rigged game. I got some, my something. What about you? Well, to see everyone here home safely, of course. I don't have much beyond that. I've lost everything in the Hellspawn attack. If I can't do anything to help the citizens of Hanalef, then... Look, it ain't my style to be messing in other people's affairs. But I've been down the road you're traveling. You don't see much green no matter where you look. Your goal's noble enough, but if noble goals were enough to keep spirits up, we'd all be winners now, wouldn't we? You, you need to find something personal you want to fight for. Something as distant as a safe return may drive you now, but you can't really reach out and hold it when the going gets real tough. Walk over. Don't tell me it's gonna sink the moment I do so. Okay, no, I guess not. I can always turn back, right? How much more of the dungeon is there? Is this just the exit to the world map? Yes, it is. Oh man, we're surrounded by so much acid. Miasma acid. A cave? No, this is too far for the villagers right now. Let's find somewhere to else to move them. But... Hmm. I feel like they should save the village for next time. Yeah, I feel, have a feeling there's going to be something bad going down there. It could possibly get all of us killed. Just like with the mana from the Forsaken Fortress. Thanks for tuning in to this Let's Play of Prayer of the Faithless. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit the bell icon.